everybody, my name is Tommy, and today we will be learning how to make Bon Bon. And just as an added bonus, I'm going to show you how to make Bonnet as well. For this tutorial, you will be needing a base. If you do not have a base, click on the link in the description below to learn how to make one. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take this base puppet apart. It will be a lot easier to work on this puppet when all the pieces are removed. But first I just want to make the head a little bigger. To make the muzzle, crumple newspaper into the shape of a half moon. Attach it to the bottom and the center of the head. To make the nose, crumble a tiny ball and place it on top of the muzzle. To make the blush, crumble two tiny balls and flatten them. Attach them to each side of the muzzle. To make the cheeks, attach a flat newspaper ball just behind the blush. Do the same to the other side. To make the ears, crumble four flat newspaper eggs. Very carefully, with a knife or scissors, cut an opening on the top and bottom of the ears. Now insert a strip of corrugated cardboard into the opening. Just like that. You might want to get an adult to help you with this. Now attach another cardboard ear to the end of the cardboard strip. And you should have something that looks like that. That is one ear. You will need two of these. Glue everything into place when you're happy with it. Now attach a small strip of cardboard at the bottom of the ears. This will be used to attach it to the head. And there you have it, a pair of ears. Now let's move on to the next step. To make the bow tie, draw two triangles and a circle on a sheet of corrugated cardboard. Just remember, anytime you're using a pair of scissors or a razor blade, always cut away from yourself. That includes your fingers. Get an adult to help you if you're not confident. And now have the ends of the triangles face each other and with a hot glue gun, glue on the circle. Just wear gloves when you're using a hot glue gun because the hot glue guns are very hot and you will burn yourself if you're not careful. So wear gloves to protect yourself. Cut out another circle for the button. To make the paws, hot glue two half moons at the bottom of the paws. Mm. 
Now cut out six cardboard sausages. Now glue on three sausages just above the half moon. And there you go, you have some rabbit paws. Now wrap two strips of cardboard on each arm. This will make Bon Bon look a little more mechanical. And now it is time to add the paper mache. Brush the surface area with glue, apply toilet paper or tissue paper on top, and brush another layer of glue on top of the tissue. You'll want to do this about two or three times. With a sharpie, draw where you want to cut out the eye holes. When you're happy with how it looks, cut out the eyes. To make the ears look nice, you'll want to detail them. Cut out four cardboard ovals and attach them to the ears just like I am right now. And now we are going to need the teeth. So cut out 12 tiny cardboard squares. To add the teeth, cut an opening on the front of the bottom jaw. You may want to get an adult to help you with the knife. Just remember to always cut away from yourself because these knives are so very sharp. And now insert the tiny square into the gap you just cut. Just like that. You want six teeth on the lower jaw and six teeth just underneath the muzzle. If you are happy with your lower jaw, Glue all the teeth into place. You should only have six teeth. However, that is up to you if you want to add more or use less. To attach the teeth under the muzzle, repeat the same process as you did with the lower jaw.
Okay, so now this puppet has all the pieces fully detailed, so she should have a head and a body, okay? You don't really need to do anything to the body except for gluing the bow tie and the button on after that. So you should have a button and a bow tie. She should have arms, detailed arms, so look more animatronic like. And the paws are on. This is the lower jaw. Should also have teeth on. Stretchy fabric glued on. The wabbit ears. We'll be gluing them on. So for this task, we will be using uh, hot glue. I want to be wearing gloves for uh, burn protection. I strongly advise that you do the same. Please wear gloves and this will protect you from burns. Now before I start assembling this puppet, I want to paint those hard to reach areas with the black paint first. So I'm going to paint the inside of the mouth. This will be a lot easier when it comes time to painting the puppet. Place the ears on top and draw with a sharpie where you need to cut the openings. Now place the cardboard end of the rabbit ear into the gap you just cut. And just like that you have attached the ear. Do the same thing to the other side. Hot glue the ears into place when you are done and happy with the ears. Now glue the chin straps back onto the head. When the jaw has been reattached, test it. Make sure that it still works. As you can see, it works just fine. Now reattach the arms and let's try the puppet. These are the paints that you will need to make Bonnet. I'm going to paint Bonnet first.
and if you want to make bonbon, these are the colors that you will need. Okay, let's start. All right, everybody, so Bon Bon's ready for the finishing touch. So just wear your safety glasses to keep the, uh, the spray out of your eyes and make sure you bring it outside so you have good ventilation. All right, let's finish this puppet, hey? Eh? Congratulations, you have just turned a boring base into just like that. I magically cleaned up my workstation and I have Bonnet. Now if you want to turn it into Bon Bon, all you have to do is snap your fingers and ta-da! There's Bon Bon, just like that. Snap of my fingers. It's magic. Well that's it everybody. I hope you enjoyed that tutorial. I had a lot of fun making Bon Bon. Here he is. Well, I hope you enjoyed that show. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you all next time. I hope you enjoyed the show. Now go make yourself a puppet friend. <laughs>